this last Saturday I was out trimming my hedges and um, I was up on a six foot ladder about four feet in the air um, and I was going across and I guess I disturbed a snake who was living in uh, my bushes here and out of nowhere um, he jumped out of the bush he struck my hand which at the time I didn't realize that I'd been struck by a snake I just knew I felt a sharp pain and so I kind of paused and that's when I see this horrible horrible <laughs> sight of this snake just coming up out of nowhere um, and what was really clear was he was getting ready to strike again so I I immediately jerked back which you can see in the video um, and then uh, forgot promptly that I was four feet in the air and so I unfortunately stepped backwards into thin air so consequently I ended up um, with what appears to be a torn ACL so we're working through that. Um, when I stepped backwards, unfortunately, the left leg went to the ground and the, um, the right leg stayed up on the ladder. So I um, managed to uh, wrench my right leg free, but not before I did some pretty major damage. Um, I did manage to swing the clippers away from me because I was using some heavy-duty um, battery-operated clippers. Um, but you know, the, the most important thing um, from all of this that I learned <laughs> We tend to forget that our yards are nature's habitat, and we have wild animals living in them um, that we necessarily don't, you know, didn't invite to the party. So, um, the big thing for me is making sure that, you know, I I had done things like left my cell phone on the other side of the yard. So, thank goodness one of my neighbors heard me and came to my rescue, and um, you know, she's she's genuinely like my hero right now. There's a few things I would do different, you know, definitely differently, and that is um, I would wear gloves, long sleeves, pants. Um, I think I will definitely be a little more respectful of the fact that we are living, you know, in in a, in a nature habitat. And um, you know, I coming from Texas, I've only lived here a couple of years, and I know in Texas I had never seen a snake that was climbing, um, you know, a six or seven foot bush. But apparently here in North Carolina, they do exactly that. <laughs> um, and uh, you know, just fortunately, I caught it on video so that I could you know share that with people. And um, you know, hopefully, if I can prevent someone else from this happening to someone else, then you know then at least it will have, have been worth it by the time I'm all done.